Is OPS a good investment for a home machine? Is it worth the money to invest in a battery-backed UPS unit for a home machine? Or is it a waste of money? The purpose of the UPS would be to prevent a meltdown of the computer due to bad power in the area, i.e. it's Toast TM. With the cost of some computers, the UPS approaches half the replacement cost of the machine, which is why I'm asking. Clarification, this answer is for the United States. Each country has their own power grid schema and have different levels of service. Here in the States, while power is plentiful and adequate, there are segments of the national grid that are getting old and are, at times, overburdened, leading to the occasional brownout. This is a rare occurrence but it is a concern. Think of preventative equipment like UPS, rate controllers, tape drives, etc. as insurance. If you're willing to risk the odds, then by all means don't get the equipment. Save a few bucks in the short term and pat yourself on the back. But like a car crash, if you value anything about the car, then insurance is worth it as life in and of itself is a gamble. Weeks, months, maybe years from then, what do you think the odds of something going wrong? Multiply that by the amount of time needed to diagnose, repair, test whatever problem occurs. If money is an issue, I can understand skimping here and there because of a lack of funds. But if money is fairly accessible and you consider your work slash computer slash data slash file slash whatever important, then not buying any preventative equipment is simply foolish. To answer your questions directly, is it worth the money to invest in a battery backed ups unit for a home machine? Do you consider your data valuable or not? If you do, then I would definitely spend the money. Dollar one forty dollar one sixty ups goes more than a long way for a home computer. There are probably cheaper units that are just as effective. I'm not saying you have to spend that amount, but there are a variety of brands available that might meet your needs. Or is it a waste of money? Prevention is seldom a waste of money. I've had numerous discs go bad in my lifetime. Then I tried software raid. What a joke. I still had data loss. Then hardware raid. No problems yet. And now NAS. Network attached storage. With an attached ups. I sleep very comfortably at night with well over 400 GB of storage. The purpose of the ups would be to. Prevent a meltdown of the computer. Due to bad power in the area. I eat its toast TM. The general idea behind the ups is uninterrupted power supply. If a brownout occurs, no problem. The up switches to the battery to supply clean power and switches back when the line is A-OK. -okay. You'd be amazed at how many brownouts slash blackouts occur when you're at work or in the middle of the night. Make sure to use the software between the computer and the ups to log issues that arise. With the cost of some computers, the ups approaches half the replacement cost of the machine, which is why I'm asking. Equipment cost aside, paying $300 for a computer and paying $150 for UPS is a meaningless comparison. Let's be clear, data is the most important thing about a computer. When you get right down to the core, the difference between one machine and another is mere perception. If you could care less about files, and all you do is browse the internet, email and play games, maybe a UPS is a bit overkill. But if you value your personal and historical, private, information, a uh, ups is but a small step towards preventing disaster. I should note there is one caveat to ups, cloud storage. If you care about your document slash pig slash whatever, you could use something like Dropbox or Amazon S3 storage to remotely back up your information leaving your home computer to chance. Granted, if you trust those providers and waive any thoughts about your privacy, then that's a free slash cheap alternative to ups. Yes, you should have one. One that is sufficient for a home computer should not be that expensive. Here's an example. Here's a quick article on some of the benefits. But, basically electrical power disturbances can cause hardware damage and even data loss.
I purchased an APC SmartUps 1500 about five years ago as the electric here kept dropping out. I've had to replace the battery once since but it's been well worth every penny, and because the computer is fairly good on power nowadays it lasts for ages when the power does do off. I've been very pleased on lots of occasions that I have it, you only need a really short power failure and all your unsaved work can be gone which is really painful, especially if you're doing a long video processing task or similar, it's also reassuring to be able to carry on working and not worry about losing unsaved work when there's a thunderstorm in the local area. So in summary yes, but be careful with your purchase as I also have a cheap one, cost CA. 30 pounds, which is rubbish, you get what you pay for, only just about up to the job or powering my network switch. Due to bad power in the area. I think these words sum it up well. If you have good power in your area, correct voltage and current, no brownouts or surges, then you probably don't need one. Anyway, here's a couple of examples. When I was younger, I lived in a shared house, bunch of guys, big house, cheap rent, lots of fun, that had shocking wiring, excuse the pun, a single fuse for the whole house. Every week or so, someone would blow that fuse, so I eventually bought a UPS. I don't use it now, because the batteries need replacing, and the power is good enough that I don't see any problems. Later on, I worked for a company that was located in an industrial area. Every time the neighbors switched on some heavy machinery, there would be a slight brownout. Voltage would drop, lights would flicker, etc. This is definitely the sort of place that needs our ups, and they had some, though not as many as we wanted. If you like this, you can get it. Please stay subscribed.